Hello and welcome to the Feature Spotlight for the Spot Notification Center. The Spot Notification Center was released with the July 2017 Spot Update in version 7.0.6598. The philosophy behind the Notification Center came as a natural progression of the web request logic that's already in Spot. With Spot Customer Connect, customers would traditionally sign up for service and that sign up would not be active until someone at the store processed the sign up through the Spot web request alert. With the newer Customer Connect and the Spot branded mobile app, we've moved away from requiring the web request to be processed, instead allowing the customer's sign up to take place instantly, which makes sense if you were to download an app and, uh, and sign up for service and then not be able to log in, you would think that something was wrong with the app. So in this, in this, uh, so in this aspect, the concept of a web request kind of goes away. However, in order to continue to provide you with the visibility you need regarding the web activity of your customers, that's where the Notification Center was born. With the Notification Center, rather than processing a web request, you simply acknowledge the web activity using the ACK column you see there on the left. You simply place a check there, you save out, and that removes the notification. To enable the Notification Center, simply go to Setup, Program Configuration, Workstation Settings, System Menu Settings, Notification Center Scope. You can set this to either All Stores in Group or Current Store based on the need of the workstation. Obviously, because this is a workstation setting, you will need to enable this on multiple workstations as you see fit. To control who can access the Notification Center, you go to Setup, Users, Groups, and Rights, Activity Rights, Select your user group, in this case I've chosen owner, and then choose notification center. You can choose to give the user group access to the current store or access to all stores. With the notification center, you are also able to take advantage of a new feature called interactive messaging. The interactive messaging is essentially the creation of a text message thread with a customer. The idea is that while Spot has been able to handle SMS replies from customers for some time, there was never really any concept of a message thread with that customer. And that's what the interactive messaging will change. It, using our API, we, post, we, we basically create a conversation with a customer each time we text them. And if they text back, we can see those messages in real time using the, message, the messages tab that's available in both the notification center and the customer view. This does require a configuration change to your Twilio site, but you can contact customer care to get started. The process usually takes about five or 10 minutes to get, to get it uh, all set up and, and, and running. Uh, thank you for watching. Um, I've listed some additional resources here. Please keep an eye on our YouTube page. There's going to be a lot more content coming here in the near future. You can also check our website for any updates. And uh, everybody is familiar with our customer care department. They do a fantastic job and, and are always happy to help. So thanks for watching and have a wonderful day.